I just realized my microphone was muted that whole time. So here we are. Starting an episode fresh. Got a bunch of stuff happening here. Probably just cut straight to that. Um, yeah, it's been it's been a 13 years since the last episode. And uh, I'm already screwing stuff up. Oh my god. Uh, I think... I'm gonna go with the Lugia. With the Lugia. What to do? What to do? This is bad, but I'm doing it. This is bad, but I'm doing it. I have Arcanine. Did I bring Arcanine? No, I did not bring Arcanine. Uh oh. So I just made a, I just made a, a fatal error. A fatal error. I didn't bring anything to hit Shedinja. But maybe I've got two, two... I got a Hydreigon and an Arcanine, so maybe my opponent just didn't bring it. Lopini Naganadal. Okay, that's fine. That's okay. That's fine. So obvious fake out is obvious. Uh, what do... Yeah. So... I don't know if this is a good move, but this is a move we're making. I'm blocking a, 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 a kind of obvious fake out. Because Lugia can tank any hit. It's kind of a beast. And our Air Blast will KO the Lopini. Our Earth Power will probably KO... Actually, it probably won't KO the Noggin at all. But an Air Blast might. Maybe. So that's no fake out, thank you. The Noggin at all goes for a Flamethrower! Oh no! Oh no! Um, okay. So, this turn, I might. I have Endeavor, and I don't know how fast this Serena is. It'll probably outspeed the Nog. No, it probably won't outspeed either of those, actually. Serena's base 70 something? 72? Or maybe it's faster than that. Let's check. What, what speed? 136. Oh no, we'll outspeed. We shall outspeed. You know, I could faint. Something probably comes in for the Lopini. So I'm going to faint Aeroblast that. Break, break a possible Focus Sash. I don't foresee Lopini staying in, and if it does, I don't really care that much. Because what I'd like to do is knock out this Noggin Adol. Lopini knocks out Serena. I get my... Is there any sin for free? Yeah, okay, we figured that. Into Shedinja. Alright, so we lose. We lose. Wait, no, wait. We don't. I'm stupid. Bug is weak to flying. What am I talking about? <laughs> what am I actually talking about? I'm a moron. Okay, so Nagadadal is gone. That's awesome. Crit was 100% guaranteed. That's the point of, of Z Tailwind. Z Tailwind gives you the effect of focus energy. So it's plus two in critical hit stat. And because Aeroblast is plus two in critical hit stat, it's guaranteed. Alright, so now we... Aeroblast Shedinja. And, uh... High jump kick the Lopini. Even if you ally switch, it doesn't matter. This is fine. Okay, so it's probably Focus Sash then. So, yep, Focus Sash. So there's the, there's the, the first hit. High jump kick connects. This might knock out. I don't know. I don't know. It does. That's nice. So now, what are we going to see? A toxic? Okay. That's annoying, but not the end of the world. Interesting that you have Tapu Fini and Toxic on the same team. Very interesting. Very interesting. So what do we do now? What, I didn't forget. I didn't forget what you even had. I honestly forget what you even had crowd on. Okay, that's fine. Uh, cause I can. Toga tomorrow is completely useless here now. The only thing Toga tomorrow helps with is setting up, um, Xerneas. So I'm gonna leave these two on the field then. The important thing. Here's the important thing. It's hitting. Shedinja with 
air blast air blast as long as long as, as long as there's not an ally switch I'd be very unhappy if there's an ally switch I still think Lugia will survive but that'd be very sad you go for shadow sneak I don't care protect okay that's annoying but not the end of the world okay so the Groudon's going after my Shedinja so you probably have shadow sneak fire punch or is it into Serena oh I'm fine with that I'm super fine with that okay Is this... How fast is this, is this Xerneas? 126. It's not fast at all. Not very fast at all. That's like little to no speed. Doesn't make me very happy. All right. Well, I need... I need to knock out this Shedinja. I need to. So it just protected. So it's either going to ally switch... Which makes me very sad. I don't think there's any reason to to even geomancy here. There's really not. Just knock out the Groudon. But basically, the way this works out is I, if as long as I hit Aeroblast, I'm knocking something out here. I want to get the Shedinja into a situation where Ally Switch does nothing, because that's that's very bad. This is a very I should not have brought Toga tomorrow. Goes to the double. We hit Aeroblast, thankfully. We already saw it was Focus Sash, so it's gone. Not a Focus Band, which is terrible for me. <laughs> but it's gone, so that's Fire Punch. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Well, we are very bulky. So that's gone, right? Yes, thank you. Woo, this team just got another win. I'm, I just pushed this team over the 50% win ratio. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was 63 battles won out of 127. 64 puts it at just... Well, not over 50%. Literally at 50%. Which is about my skill level. So I'm very excited about that. All right, let's get another one. That was fun. That was fun. Okay. Uh, no save. No, no save the battle. I gotta remember to edit out the first part of that video where literally nothing happened. So yeah, if you're wondering why the video starts um, just at the battle, it's because I talked for about three minutes beforehand with the microphone muted because I am a silly person. I am I am a smart man. I have a degree in engineering. I'm very smart. I'm probably the smartest moron you know. Totem Pokemon. I don't even know them Pokemon. Uh, I like this team. It's kind of fun. I don't only play one battle with it, but it's kind of fun. Um, I, I wish I could check the stats before I actually battle, because I'd like to know what the speed is on Hydreigon. I assume it's just timid max speed if it's, it's running Life Orb and not Tailwind. So that's a thing. Um, AJ! AJ, AJ! 15, 15, Ooh, okay, so... Interesting. Very interesting. Xerneas is going to be valuable here. This is very bulky, Xerneas. I think Arcanine will be really nice here. It's got Will-O-Wisp. Ooh, it's got Will-O-Wisp. Will-O-Wisp. You know Hydreigon's very good here, too. got Dark Pulse and Earth Power. Which I like. Okay. I, 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 I genuinely don't really know what I'm doing. I don't have any terrain control. Because like I want to bring Toga tomorrow and paralyze things, but I don't have any terrain control. So... I have a plan. It's not a good one. Do I even bring Lugia? Do I? No. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Um, 
I have a plan that's a bad one. It's very bad, because I genuinely don't know what I'm doing. But I'm thinking we just set up Xerneas. We just fake out, set up Xerneas, and then uh, go to town. When's the Cot Lunala? That's fine. That's okay. My opponent has a Serena. So, would you send it in here? Would you send it in here? So, if I Geomancy and Fake Out, if you taunt me, that's bad. I got a better idea. Okay, so this works if you don't send in Tapu Fini. This works if you don't send in Tapu Fini. Okay, so Lunala stays in. Lunala's got just Tailwinds. Alright. And I'm half expecting a Z move from... Okay, it's not a Z move, it's just a Moon Guy's Beam. We, we, we survived that. We, got, we have an Assault Vest. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah. Oh, we can take three of those. Look at that. Oh, we can take we can take two. We'll get knocked out on the third one. Alright. Okay. Here's the plan. Alright, so now do you Do you switch in your Tapu Fini here? Or do you go for a taunt a taunty taunt? I'm pretty bulky, so I think I can take the move. I, would, I wouldn't be surprised if you brought in Tapu Fini. And this was really helpful against Tapu Fini Whimsicott, but you didn't, it looks like. Yeah, Encore. Okay. So you're just going for the Z move? Yep. Yep. Z move. I knew it. That's going into the Xerneas, I assume, which will do good damage, but from what I can tell, we're pretty bulky. It's hard to tell, but I think we're pretty bulky. Wow, is that what my camera looks like? That is not... I'm not very happy with that. I am not happy with that at all. When I get a, I get a little bit of extra extra cheese, I should fix that. Oh, it's into a... It's into Serena. It's into Serena. So... That's fine. We're coming back in... 3, 2, 1, go! Yeah. So that did, uh... Not a good amount of damage. Good amount of damage. I, I kind of like the Focus Sash a lot with Endeavor, especially. It's really nice. So now we're pretty free to. If only I had um. If only I had nuzzled the Lunala previously. That would have been really nice. Is my is my Serena faster? No, it's not, because I'm plus two. It is normally. Before the Geomancy. So... I'm going to double into Whimsicott here. Just to... In case Lunala protects, just to break... Okay. Is this a Feeny? Incineroar. Okay. High jump kick would have been better. I expected Feeny to come in, if anything. But that's not terrible. It's not terrible. Lunala... Oh yeah, Tailwind. Let's see. Lunala's still faster. What am I doing? See, here it would be great to have Lugia. Because then I could psych up. And that'd be, that'd be chill. And this won't do... Enough. Is that a crit? No. It. What, what am I like? Modest max special attack. That did a lot of damage. Uh. So, I think Arcanine here is probably pretty good. Yeah, Arcanine's pretty good here. Rayquaza. Oh, this is really good. This is really good. We get Intimidate. We've got Dazzling Gleams. We got Gleamsies. Now it can survive a Dazzling Gleam if it's. If it's uh, the thing. I could snarl. I could. How many times tailwind? One? 
Okay, I actually am going to protect here. And I'm going to snarl. Because I like... Only this is bad is if the Whims Whimsicott switches in here. That would actually be bad. But that's not going to happen. Oh, no. That's a good play. That's a really good play. That's such a good play. Oh, God, that's a good play. Because if I just attack there... That was a good call. Good call. So the problem now is that I'm protecting and I can be Encore next turn. Granted, the Whimsicott is paralyzed. So there's that. But my opponent expected me to do that. Expected me to, to predict a double up. And then just went for that. So Snarl here is nice. I could... This turn, I think I'm going to... I'm not going to knock out the Whimsicott this turn. I am going to Moonblast. And I am going to Will-O-Wisp into Rayquaza. I think that's the best play. Encore. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. So, we get a Dragon Ascent, which sucks. It'll do a good chunk. Probably, what, like half? More than half. That's Is that banded? That's a lot of damage. Oh, no! That's awful! Alright, so here... I'm going for it again. I'm, I really need that Will-O-Wisp to hit. Rayquaza could switch out. Which is fine. As long as... So we protect this turn. And the next turn... We knock out Whimsicott. This Encore is so annoying. Yep. Okay, so, but we break, we've broken Shadow Shield. We've broken Shadow Shield. And if you Encore me, that's fine, because that's what I wanted anyways. You go for a Tailwind. Okay. Now it comes down to... The War of the Wisps. So we might lose because we missed that Will-O-Wisp. That's not good. That's not super bueno. How many turns of Encore left? Here's what we do. Next turn when Encore ends, we're gonna, we have to be able to fake out that Whimsicott. So we can then start just blasting stuff. That's the play. Well, now I'll take some burn damage. I can knock out Whimsicott with Arcanine. I can knock out Lunala with Arcanine. But I need to be able to get rid of um, Rayquaza. So they hopefully are doubling into... Yes, that's good. That's good. And I think that was an attacking move of some kind. That was an attacking move of some kind. I don't know what. But now... Now we're good. Now we're good. We should be good now. I think Dazzling Gleam is better. Because I think it'll still knock out Whimsicott. Judging by from how much damage that did to the Incineroar, I think this will knock out Whimsicott and put the Lunala in Snarl range. And then if we come in, Intimidate the Rayquaza, I guess we can do it. It just depends on how much damage everything does. That We really, really need that burn. That burn was so crucial. That miss sucked. Okay, this is great. This is free damage. This is really free damage, especially if we knock out Whimsicott here. I think we, I think we will. Thank you. Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay, so I think we're good. <sighs> do we outspeed this Rayquaza? I sure, I sure believe we do. We have to intimidate though, because if it is banded, extreme speed would knock us out. 
It actually might still. That's really bad. I actually think... I have to... No, I think I just have to go for it. I, I need it to survive. I just need it to I just need Zerns to survive at extreme speed. That's what I need. I don't know what the damage roll is, because I don't know the I didn't build these Pokemon, I don't know. It's a rental team, so I have no idea. But I sure hope so. I hope we survive it. I hope we survive it. Come on! Okay, Xerneas. Oh, that's a mistake. You, you, so you predicted the protect. Okay. Okay, I'm glad I didn't go for it. Glad I didn't go for it. You were correct. So it, it is banded Rayquaza. It has to be. from for, If you lock into extreme speed, you have to be. All right, well, there we go. Woo! Look at us. Look at us. No Lugia required. Oh, man. What a fun time. What a fun time. We're having a good time. All right, AJ. We did it. Yay! We won! Two, is that two games we won? In a row? It's impossible. Two consecutive wins? That never happens. We're, we might even just be in the 1500s. I believe we are. Well, anyways, that's it for Ladder Up, y'all. Uh, see you again in another 12 years for the next episode. And I uh, hope, you, hope you're... Probably want to... Uh, <laughs> Ring that subscription notification bell so that you uh, no are notified when the next episode happens. It's probably going to happen. Today's Friday. It'll probably happen Monday because I'm sitting down and I'm going to record another one. And uh, yeah, hope to see you back next time for another episode of Ladder Up.